Hey guys, it's Cameron with Bandzoogle, and today I'm here to show you how to utilize the custom form feature on your site as a booking form. The custom form feature allows you to add multiple fields, which is perfect for a booking form on your band's site. To get started, we'll go to the Edit Content tab and select Pages. Then, we'll select the page we'd like to place the booking form on. From here, we'll select Add Feature, and then select the Custom Form feature here. Then, we'll place it on the page. After that, we'll enter a title for the custom form and hit Create New Form. By default, the custom form feature has a section for a name, email address, and message. Using the Add Field button here, we can start adding more fields to the form to create our booking form. First, we'll need to add a title to the section and then select a type. We can choose from a few options. Short text, where a visitor can add a short message. Big text, where a visitor can add more details to their messages. Checkboxes, where a user can select from a range of options. Multiple choice, where a user can choose an option from a list. And date, which is a great way for a user to add the date of the show. In today's example, we'll be adding fields for checkboxes, multiple choice, and a date. When we add an option, we can also check the box to make this field required. This is good to use if it's a critical detail. Once we've added all the fields, we can edit them using the pencil icon next to each field, or remove them using the delete button next to each field. If you'd like to rearrange the sections of the form, you can click and drag the up and down arrows next to each field. Once our form has been set up, we can hit save to move on to the next steps. In the form options section, we can adjust our form's title, as well as add a submission received message to let visitors know the message has been sent. If you'd like to change the email address submissions are sent to, you can enter another email address in the send notifications to box here. By default, notifications are sent to your Banzoogle login email. Additionally, we can set a page to send the visitor to after the message is sent. If you'd like to review all the messages you've received, you can go to the submission section of the form here. And that's it for today guys, so thanks for watching, and we hope you're enjoying your website powered by Banzoogle.